The head of the company building the Dakota Access Oil Pipeline says the company won't consider rerouting it to address American Indian concerns. The $3.8 billion pipeline to carry North Dakota oil to Illinois is largely complete except for a stretch under a Missouri River reservoir in North Dakota. The Standing Rock Sioux fears a leak could contaminate drinking water on its nearby reservation. The, that, that's the least impactful. This is, this is paralleling two other pipelines that have already been built in this location that go under the lake at that location, a, a high, high voltage power line. It is the least impactful to the environment, least impactful to historical sites. It will, there's no impact actually. I don't mean to, to sound in any way uh, uh, the, the, this take it or leave it kind of thing, we, we, would in, we are willing to entertain if somebody would like to, to engage with us and talk about the safety and the likelihood of, of any issues ever occurring, we would love that. Uh, we would welcome that. And there may be some input that, that influences what we do, but, but as far as the route, that, that, that's not going to change. The Army Corps of Engineers has delayed approving the river crossing, calling for more tribal input. Energy Transfer Partners has asked a federal judge to declare that it has the right to drill under the river. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.